still doing up season two, you know. The Statement Podcast. If you haven't subscribed yet, please. What are you waiting for? The no Statement more. GTO. Go there. Check that out. Do with it. Bo, 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 you know bo. what I'm saying? Right. It feels a bit weird. My co host. Co host. <laughs> See, you know, yeah, I yeah. got a watch right now. He's, hey, man, he's living up to his name. Listen. Longers. It's very unlike Longers. Longers. No, very it's unlikely. very unlike Longers, but, but I think the name just took effect today. You know what I mean? So <laughs> here we go. Yeah. I'm just going to roll with the punches still. You got a special so today, guest. Today, we've got a special guest. In fact, you know what, Jay? We say, you know, I'm good, we're man. Doing this? No, yeah, we're yeah, doing we're this. Good, yeah. I, got, yeah. I got your back like yeah. Carol Pratt, you know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> cool. Well, today we've got one of London's top, 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 my go-to sound, yeah? Come on. My go-to sound. Come on. I do my brand of statement. Yeah. And forever. Every flyer. They're, they're, they're on there, yeah? yeah? yeah. So yeah. that's my go-to sound, London's finest. We're going to introduce into the studio, Pure Vibes. Bo, 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 bo. Woo! What are you saying? You like that intro there? Yeah. 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 Big, big up the man them still. Big up in Chi. So yeah, yeah. You, I, was gonna, I was just going to ask you, can you introduce yourself individually? All right, cool. Yeah. I'm Davda, Pure Vibes. Yeah, Davda, you're leading, by the way. Yeah, you know, you knew the notes. Every time. Yeah. <laughs> in Chi, Pure Vibes. Yeah. Come on, come on. Yeah, so... um. It's not even a proper interview, bro. It's a conversation, you yeah, know? Yeah, we have this this sort of relationship where I can phone Inchi and say, like, what I liked, what what I think he could do next, yeah. rare, rare. But he's going to lead anyway. You're going to lead, bro. Like, so it's from the... I'll ask you one of the key questions, the, the lead questions. Like, when did you not get started? Um, I joined the sound in 2019, but I was, like, around the sound from, like, 2017. So how long has the sound been going on? Oh, well... It's going to be the 18 year anniversary this year. Okay, so you're not the, the first people to hold the sound name? I'm not, but Inchi was. Yeah, this Inchi is interesting. Yeah. This is very interesting. Very interesting. So, Inchi, when did Pure Vibes first start? 2005. Because when I first noticed you guys, it was you and Invasion. Like, like it's like a tag team kind of. Is that, mm-hmm. am I right when saying that? Or? No, just, uh, we're just another sound from. The same area. Okay. He's from North West as well. Yeah, well, North West West is where we're based, but uh, uh, that's where we reside. But we represent the London the full and the UK as well. Where'd you lot grow up? Uh, Western North West as well. Where, where about? Oh, area wise, uh, Labour Grove. Grove, yeah. I was in Alperton. Okay. And Stum. Okay. Sounds all posh, Dan. Yeah. Nah, it's not hey, posh, but it's not posh. posh, no? posh. <laughs> I thought so. Oh, okay. <laughs> and then it turned into this little estate. I was like, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm trying to think the first time we bucked up, but maybe we'll get to that. So let's start from the very beginning. Pure Vibes, a bit. 2005. Yeah. So um, I used to DJ before. Well, I could still DJ, but I've always DJ, learned on uh, records. Mm-hmm. They made a the transition to CDs. And then um, obviously now we're at laptops. But I've always been into music and the sound system era growing up on that so it's always been kind of who did you get that from uh parents yeah yeah, yeah. yeah parents uh, always dad built, mom do? uh both of them were into music their parents also used to keep sound things in jamaica oh shit. Is that so, yeah, fingers yeah. deep yeah so it's deep it's not that i just fall into music yeah, it's just, yeah, yeah i've kind of grown with it as i've gone in in terms of taking it serious so not many people can say grandparents you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. a lot of people say their dad but yeah, you know like yeah, grandparents yeah, yeah. It's true. Yeah, yeah. so you can see that when we play music it's not from a place of uh we're jumping on the hype no it's the foundation is there the dna thing yeah, yeah, yeah. And, it, and there's a way in which you play music it's not just play music for hype and yeah, that they'll talk about later on, but it's the way you play music. Where, where, where did you grow up? Sorry. Oh, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. A common question we ask on there, um, I don't feel about it for a long time, but record shops. What's your first record shop? Do you remember the first record you bought as well? Uh, one, and that'll I go for you as well, Davda. I um, I've, I've, I've done Big Apple. The Big, Big Apple was in um, Croydon. No one said that yet, you know? Yeah, Big Apple. Mm. I've done... Um, uh, Croydon, that's another country. Yeah, well, <laughs> I remember that was a whole day. Saturday. Um, there, um, dub dub vendor. I've done, I've done. Um, mm. uh, what's the one in Uptown Records? Mm-hmm. This is uh, Cameo. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh, what was the other ones? HMV. When I used to buy some records from yeah, HMV. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Um, first track though, first record. First record. First record. Mem- oh, it, I think it was Sh- Shaggy. Um, oh. the blue one, Angel. Ah, yeah, that's the first record. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah, I think that was the first record actually. What about you, Dev? Carl, the first record I owned myself, it wasn't my dad's, it was a Serato tone control thing. <laughs> you know, the Serato, 
yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I, I, I was... He's a different generation. Yeah, different. man. Like, yeah. I would go and see them, like, they're looking cool in HMV and that. That's what I know. Yeah, and yeah. And when I drive past them, and I go, oh, look, record shop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's did, it. Did you ever touch vinyl? Yeah, but only from my, like, my dad had um, record players and vinyls, so I was, that's what I was using a little bit, yeah. but okay. even then myself, nah, nothing. So yeah. what did your dad do? Who? He was, um, he was part, he was, like, rolling with sounds from young. Okay. So, like, Volcano and Saxon when he went south and okay. blah, blah. But then, yeah, yeah. yeah, so that's how I kind of got my knowledge. And I always remember he just played tapes. Like every day when I come home from whatever, go nursery, come home, tapes, yeah, school yeah. tapes. Yeah. I'm like, all right. Yeah. And then he's always trying to teach me what they're saying. And I, and I couldn't, I don't know what no one's saying. Bro. <laughs> and then eventually I was like, I was like, oh, I like this. This is good. Yeah. And then yeah. Yeah, that's where it comes from. Okay. So what year, what year was that then? Um, What, as in me? The, the, yeah, the Serato, that first oh, equipment, piece of equipment. 2016. Okay. 10. Okay. 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 All right. Yeah. So 2005, we're still there. So you you you've formed a sound. Who named it? You. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, name? yeah. Pure vibes. Yeah, yeah. And was it you on your own, or you? Uh, there somebody? was me and Shorty Best that started it. Okay. Yeah. Well, me okay. kind of lead with it. Then he joined, and then uh, I think we got two seven parted ways kind of thing. He did his own thing. I continued. Then 2009. There were Tricks, who used to MC on Grime when I used to DJ. He joined, was the MC. He was on sound for about so four. So did you start on Grime? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Grime, okay. So way back. So when you talk about records, you talk about 98? No, 88, very school. So it was about 2001. Yeah. yeah. Probably around that time, year 10, 2002. Yeah, year, yeah. yeah, around them times there. Okay. When I started by my uh, new lark. Uh, direct job, direct job. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, <laughs> them times that I lock a mix and leave it, yeah, yeah and yeah. then walk away. Oh, yeah. and, and the mix is lit. Both so DJs. All, all, all now I can still lock a mix like that. Yeah. That's, that's how we learn. Okay. Lock a mix and leave it. Ones, it. Yeah, even now, even going for the laptop, lock a mix, like, mix and leave it. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's how you learn to mix. Okay. If you block out the laptop screen, you can go back to that kind of way because you're using tempo fader and yeah, yeah, and using your ears. Yeah, and using your ears because nowadays you can see the DJs. They just look at the laptop. They're not even looking at the crowd. The yeah. crowd might be standing up stiff. Yeah. Pause. But then they might yeah. be just not doing that. Yeah. 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 yeah, I mean, so you've uh, got to look at the crowd, yeah, and that's yeah. what their ears, your ears do, because they have to have listen, and your eyes are use, you're using your eyes and your ears at the same time, plus your hand but when the, you're mixing. The new DJs have got the the sync button. So I love that as well. Yeah, it's not even taught themselves yet. Yeah, I'm not saying that. You see, like man, that's learnt off of doing it manually. You can still go and use the sync button and be all right, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But yeah, if you've learnt off sync, you don't something don't know. Yeah, yeah if your laptop starts, if it's hot, yeah, and your laptop starts going like this. And the waveforms are moving like that. You're not, you're, not, you're not gonna know if it's in, bro. You know what I'm saying? And if you try listening, you're gonna go, oh shit, I never listen to music. Yeah. <laughs> and that's the thing. <laughs> yeah. It's good yeah. to learn manually. You can do the automatic thing if you want. Just, yeah. Just like in terms of circumstance, but mm. yeah. a lot of people have learned off of mm. just the 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 the, the computer DJ things. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Long as that. I think long as it's outside. Yeah. Zoom yeah. forward and January is good. Yeah. yeah. So after tricks. Yeah, you came after that. Then. So then after that, Tricks left in two twelve. Was you on radio stations as well? Yeah, so did um Freeze FM and all the pirate ones. Which ones? Freeze FM, Freeze FM. Uh, Magic. Uh, was it Magic FM? Uh, Greg Grime. Mm -hmm. Did guest shows on One Extra. Big. Um, Platinum FM, Big. and then Platinum. yeah, yeah. and then That's when there was <laughs> then, then there was a transition where radio. Like the, the dates started to come in mm -hmm. frequently and I was like, you know what? SoundCloud is obviously the way to get heard now. So there's no point. Yeah, Unless yeah, I've yeah. gone on a legal radio station, I'm not bothering with radio. So it was more mixes, iTunes and SoundCloud. So obviously we moved ch transferred to that kind of yeah, yeah, way yeah. of promoting yourself, which is still current now. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So the whole kind of um, uh, radio, unless it's legal, which Dub does on, I don't really... Yeah, probably yeah, that anymore. Probably past that time. Yeah, like in the early days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to get heard, isn't it? Yeah. And that, and I remember that was the platform to get heard. Yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah. like it's been replaced now with yeah, yeah. SoundCloud or yeah. YouTube or yeah, yeah. TikTok. Or I'm surprised Instagram. though, there's still people are still advertising on radio. I was speaking to someone down to today, and they're yeah. still advertising the last four weeks in on radio. I'm like, ain't that a waste of money? It, so. it, it depends. So. On, it depends on the generation. Yeah, as well. it depends on what you're advertising. If you're advertising big people dance. That's what, right. that's what it yeah. was. That's what it was. If you're saying under 18s and that, 
No, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's yeah, that's, yeah. that's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. I, didn't even, I didn't even think of it like that. But yeah. Yeah. You're right. yeah. But it's you're also right. the you have to cover much more mediums now, yeah. in terms of outlets to people because. Back in the day, you used to be flyer. No one really flyers like that now. No, so no. everybody rolls with a board and promotes mm. their event. Mm. Yeah, and you're going, and then on top of that, you've got social media that's doing a lot of Just that as well. Yeah. Plus, you've got Instagram, you've got um, Twitter, you've got Snapchat, you've got mm. TikTok. Yeah, you've all got promote on. Some of these days is like the, it's like and the society. Million. It's almost like secret societies in, in raves these days because we feel like for them all right, them all right things like you know they're yeah. all white like cocoa and stuff like. Yeah. I think that, that I didn't, I never really saw that get over promoted. To, to how much people went to it. Do you know what I mean? We've got mate, but that's the thing, it's the data and the mailing list. So, yeah, yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. data and the mailing list. Now. I'm just plus, if, you, if you're talking to, so generally the crowd for uh, All White Coco is generally a 40 plus crowd. Yeah. So yeah. they're of the generation of radio, emails, text messages. Mm. So it's still working quite So well. that works for them. Yeah. But obviously, if you go under 40s now, it's more social media mixed with some text messages. So yeah. you've got to use different things to the, the target audience you're trying to get to. Give me an example of an event that, that, that you would do in a new in a new style. So my anniversary, for example, oh yeah. God, sorry, mine, it's ours. Our anniversary, um, coming up, second of state, so we've got to do... And where's the anniversary, what? Um, oh, Pure Pure no, no, what, what, what number? Oh, 18. 18? Yeah. 18? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You might not even need to show that. You know, you look at you now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Started oh, young, man. Started young still. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. Um, so with that now... Share your age. We've got to do stuff. <laughs> not even that old as well. You would be surprised. Um, <laughs> <laughs> looks, looks so deceiving. Yeah. You've got um, social media. Yeah. Um, then you've got mailing lists. Mm-hmm. Then you've got uh, the, the audio. Yep. Yeah. Um, and then you've got what else is there? Giving away the gems, though, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, kind of thing. Yeah, talk, like, even, but yeah, talking to people and all of that works as well. Mm. If, if if you say if if a person is you play and they like it and you talk to them after or whatever, and you go, oh yeah, and we got an anniversary coming up, they might roll. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, more yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, more time. Yeah. If they want to hear that again, mm. what they want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you wouldn't be in the business eighteen years if it wasn't yeah. if it wasn't popping. Yeah. <laughs> but it's not only that as well. You've got to understand psychology. Yes. as well like you have to understand that people learn in three ways yes i can talk about them but i don't want to drop too many gems no, but true, yeah but you can't, <laughs> you can't play dumb in this but, but but audio visual and kinetic okay, so you yeah. can't you can't always touch people pause so you gotta <laughs> then get to them through audio and then visual yeah so if you're covering those bases your your in terms of your brand and how you promote yourself there's a level of awareness there yes that yeah. a lot of people don't look into what made you know that i study i'm a student yeah, yeah. Still, still, still learning, isn't it? Always still learning. Always. And in the earliest stages, what made you say, do you know what? Like, I need to do this because you must have done some innovative things. You know what it was? Um, and after joining the Simons, a blessing, because yeah, I can say that. But uh, and the reason why I say that is because, as a DJ, the division I see the sound going to. Yeah. I because I'm trying to play music, and then help get to the vision that yeah. I see the sound. I yeah. can't do everything. Yeah, yeah 100%. Yes. So Dab the Covered Log has taken away the music element from me in terms of staying on top of the music. And um, we still have, com- we have meetings all the time. Just keeping it fresh. Of, yeah, it? keeping it fresh. But I in terms like, of, I now my energy is focused on where do we need to get to? No, no, yeah. I, so I, now I, I can I push, can I, can see that. I can push more effort into that, which yeah. before I couldn't because yeah. I was tied up yeah. playing music. When you're in the music, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who, that you're, you're in it, yeah, but then Inchi's now out of it a little bit yeah. so you can see a bigger picture. Bigger picture, yeah. It's, it's, it's just using experience to yeah. organize different yeah. things. Because yeah. I, I can go, like back, to, can I can to go back to when um, I phoned you and said, Right, I'm doing a trip to St. Lucia yeah. called Island Escape. Tried this project, mm. didn't have the funds and budget to, to go all the way with it, but yeah. we had we had a yeah. good time, made the most of it. Um, so I brought over Pure Vibes. And it was you as the DJ. Yeah. And you had a, I don't even think you had a mic, man. No, 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 not at the time, yeah. So, and I wasn't at the time, I wasn't even confident so enough to pick up the mic. The, so. pers- the person you're seeing today, and that's why that's why I call you yeah, an admirer, yeah, yeah. because the person you're seeing today wasn't that person in 2016, yeah, I think it was. Yeah, when yeah, went 16, there. Yeah, yeah. Like, now you're on, you're on the mic and you're so unique, you're on anything you can stand on. Like, because <laughs> whatever, yeah, tables, yeah, whatever, yeah, and, yeah, yeah. and making noise and... Yeah. Yeah, flowers, flowers, bro, flowers to pure vibes. Like from that to where you are now, 
Yeah, it's mad. Yeah, but as I said, I always have to give him no. credit as well because mm. it, it is a team in it. Listen, and, it's the same uh, model uh, yeah. I had when, obviously, as long as yeah. they're there to yeah. back it. But when we had GNs going, there was the sound that's been there from 95. And yeah. we're now in 2000 and wherever it was. Yeah. We brought Slick in. Yeah. So it's exactly yeah. the same mm. model that I'm seeing with yeah. that. Yeah. That is a younger generation that you weren't even in the dances mixing and tunes there that you're mixing. Mm. Yeah. Like so, you said, 2016 you started. You, you're, the way you're playing music, bro, is like, how? But mm. you, you're, you're in it. And that's the same thing and the same model that I had with Pops. Slick. So I've, I've seen it. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, yeah, big up. I'm like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, well done. That's the big up. Well done. That's yeah. I always well done. know there's yeah. a lineage of it. You know, mm-hmm. like people that's always got a good experience of playing music mm. and selecting music as well. As a, you know, like that, them two together have to meet as well. You know, what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's good. That's that's it's good. And that's man. why I always it's have good. to give them the credit because you have to, yeah. The reason, but you've got to give yourself credit as well because yeah, you, yeah. no, 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 yeah. you saw the vision. You saw the vision. Yeah, but I don't. I, I, it's not. It's not about. It's not about um, me giving myself credit because I, I just feel like I'm just doing what I'm supposed to be doing. But in terms of Dabda, Dabda is somebody that is, um, is like, he's very open to new things. How mm-hmm. did you not meet? Oh, good question. Good question. Good question. Twitter. <laughs> Twitter. Yeah. yeah. And what, yeah. what made you connect? Um, You messaged me. Yeah. So I heard your mix. I must have posted some SoundCloud mix or something. Yeah. And then, yeah. What was it? What, 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 did, what, what caught your attention? You know what it was? At that point, when Davda, we met at 17, 19, was on there, them times there, I was already looking at the next step now, because I'm like, all right, cool. I've had two people that's left. And I'm like, all right, if, in order for me to take it where I want it to go, I need to be the face of the sound in the sense of being the MC. Oh, so you said but, that to yourself? Yeah, you because be that, yeah, but I had to, because there's DJs, there's so many DJs, but in terms of finding a good host, that's far and few between. Mm. And, and you know that already, mm, yeah, like, yeah, being yeah, out there. So yeah. I was like, all right, cool. I ain't, like I, I find a younger DJ, and then I'll have to teach myself the same way I'm teaching. And COVID was a blessing, yeah, as well because I spent I spent we spent a lot of time learning music. Um, Dab like Dabda, when he first joined, he was raw in the sense mm, of mm, mm. Um, he didn't know how to pace his sets. Yeah, but now, yeah. like. Yeah. When you say pace it, because I I got a problem with this. So when you when you say pace it, pace. So you got an hour to play. Yeah. Once you go up there, you can't go back. Hundred percent. So. Hundred percent. Sometimes when he play first your, started, it's your strengths. It's not only that, but it's, it's how to make him mix CDs. Yeah, it's different to me, but yeah. it's also just pace. It's just like our pace. You can like, stay mix CD. You can start up here. Yeah. If you yeah. want. Yeah, if you, you want to keep, 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 you can keep, 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 keep it as well. Yeah, 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 in the dance when everything's yeah. happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If people, you start there, yeah, it's gonna be hard. It's mad. To, to when, it. when I say play to your strength, like because some DJs play super fast, and then they get to a point and they're stuck, mm. and then that super fast ain't. If you're gonna play super fast, do that for the whole hour. Mm. Yeah, don't be doing super fast for twenty minutes and then you run out. Yeah, that's, that's my pace. that's my problem. Yeah, and that's pace. Yeah, yeah. Okay. that's exactly that's, right. yeah, that's yeah, my yeah, problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pace. Yeah, yeah. I think it comes down to believing in yourself and the music, like because if you're not believing in what you're playing, you're just gonna zang out like mm. every, every time. Mm. You're just gonna be like, yeah, this one, nah, that one's better. Mm, mm, mm. And then if you think if you don't believe in yourself, you don't think that you can keep it calm for half an hour. Mm. And then go boom. Mm. If you go boom, like, like you just said, mm. it's gonna go like that. But you want mm. to go like that. Boss quick, dead, yeah. finish. Yeah. No round two. Sometimes yeah. you're not the main guy, and I, I yeah. mean, every DJ wants to be the main guy more time. And I think that's a, that's a problem with um, some of the events nowadays. Not everybody can play the position. <laughs> exactly. What do you feel about early early warm sets? It's most important. Thank you. Mm, it's one of the most okay. important sets. Okay. Yeah, and there's so much music to play in the early warm as well that people feel like. They have to rush to the, the new so stuff. You, so you ain't got a problem with doing early sets? For most of the events, we still do early sets. And that's the thing. We do early, we do main, we do middle, we do end. Mm. So you, you never really, every, no, no dance is always the same for us. Because mm. mm. you have to go in there with a different approach. Mm. You mm. can't go in there with one trick and expect that to constantly work. It's not going to work. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so what about the, what's the highlights then so far? Because... You've been across, you've been across the nation now. Mm. You've done countries, so tell, just jump into the highlights, big the big moments. And you know, I feel like maybe we should jump into the to the highlights as they've been together because you see, because the the gap between two thousand and five mm. 
to to do. I don't know. I don't know if you look. Since 2016. Yeah. yeah. Like, well, if you, it's up to you if you want to go. Yeah, easy. I'm easy. I'm easy. I'm easy. I think just. I'm easy. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just I think this one should be more dubbed the lead. So yeah, yeah that might be the shirt as well. The only reason I think he's going that direction is because some people have left. So I think he wants to just. Start from the, the, I, the two of them. I'd prefer that as well, actually. Yeah, that's, well, that's pure cool. vibes. As, uh, as I've no, I've said it. Like you was there, but then now you're there. So let's go. Let's go to the there. Mm-hmm. Let's go to 2019. Yeah, even was it like the there, first, <laughs> the first set, the first yeah, pure vibes set for Dab Dab. First night. Yeah. What was Dab Dab's pure? Newspaper pure vibes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's I, that for your mind? How was he feeling? I remember there was one dance. I think it was Vendi's dance, and then. Yeah, but I was just gassed to be playing music, but I was playing that cartel. I was like, I never played cartel in front of people before. Okay. This is lit. Yeah, they get okay. me that. I was just, I was fresh because prior to that, I was playing like, like college parties or Afro, like, it was, I was playing Afro swing and that's what I was like playing. Right. So when I joined Pure Vibes now, it's different, like R&B, dance or house, everything. So yeah, yeah. yeah, that first set, I was just shook, but yeah. I was like super happy to yeah, play yeah, music. Because yeah. similar to what, what they've done to sl- for Slick, yeah. I feel like because you know, there must be bad DJs that are slightly angry with you when they see you. Cause, you know, like you got jumped up the ladder quickly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Street, street. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but 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 the problem what people don't understand is that um, with that perception because mm. it is a perception. It is. That's what I'm saying. People don't understand the amount of hours that we put in. No, no, that's why. We're and, and that's and that's why I have to mention that because yeah. as much as people might say it as oh, you know, Dab just come out of nowhere and within four years he's done X Y Z, which yeah. he's done a lot, but. It, it's the work that we put in in the background like mm-hmm. we do put in a lot of work so yeah. you do meetings so like you meet, said it, there's meetings there practice is, um, I want to, we practice when we're on set but in terms of um, we have a feedback loop yes oh how did that go what do you think of that oh, what do you think of that set we know when we shelled and we know when we haven't or we, mm-hmm. there's no, yeah. we know when things we can work on um, so and, some, and yeah. sometimes we don't know and someone else said yeah like, hard, like we have people that advise yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's actually late, but what we got time? <laughs> what, what time your car is dread? It's Carla one half near time, you know? yeah. What time your car is dread? Yeah. What's happening? It's so happening. so we're living yeah. up to your name today, yeah? Boy, today. Hey, <laughs> you know, so gone straight. Yeah. Go on, just continue. Oh, I lost my foot. You know, Chu Long was on TV. Chu was on TV. Yeah. He, he, was, he was on TV last week. That's what it is, yeah? Yeah, okay. yeah he's on TV. Now it's right. too big for us, you know what I mean? I'm not impressed, man. I'm not impressed. He has to come Give us a bad name, late. you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You late. Oh, yeah. <laughs> True Idris appearance. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, the feedback loop. Yeah, so it's constantly after every set, we have feedback loop. Bro. What do you think? What can we work on? Et cetera, et cetera. Right. Um, and then we're always building um, different jugglings. Yeah. Um, so there's always new, and then I'm always still a collector of music. Mm-hmm. So when I don't have music, I'm sourcing that music because okay. I don't like to be in a position where I don't have something. Okay. So if you have to buy the song, buy the song. But I'm like, nah, I've always said, no, I'm not having. It. I'm not. I don't like not having the music that I feel that we can play. Okay. Okay. Some events, so. So going back to that first set then. So nervy? Did you clang? Um. Nah. It wasn't a clanging thing. It's more of a. Yeah, no, I didn't clang. But I was like, bit, if, I, if I look back and, and deep the way I played the music, like, I'd be like, what are you doing? Yeah. yeah. Young man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you yeah, get yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. But, like, yeah. Not, but I hope... Four, four years later. Yeah, and I hope four years not for, down the line I can say the same thing. Okay. Because yeah. it should be that... Improvement. improvement yeah. Kind of like, cool, no, kind of. like, knowledge is power yeah, with music. Yeah. To be honest. Do you remember what, what the set was? What you was playing? We played, like, mid-school. Playing, like, self-defence and... That, that, I think we started okay, R&B okay. and then went... Okay. Dance yeah. Yeah. Do you remember that dance? No, uh, which one? Uh, no, there one? was um, um Supreme Teams one, it? That was the first one, wasn't it? Oh, was that it? Not yeah, Bendy's first one, no, Oh, that's what I'm one. talking about. That's yeah, what I'm talking Supreme about. Team one, yeah. yeah, Supreme Team. Yeah, November. Ram, November. Dance yeah. Ram? Dance Ram? Was it, was it nice? nice. Yeah, it was nice. Yeah, it was nice. nice. We were yeah, playing kind of early-ish. Yeah, about people coming nice. as we were playing, so yeah. It was yeah. Good, yeah. Okay, and then that was the first dance that you was on the mic then? Yes. Yeah. How did that go? Oh, that was all right. Uh, but listen back to it now. Compared Four years to, later, would you say the same thing like that? But uh, again, it's evolution, isn't it? Yeah. So you have yeah. to listen to yourself, yeah. and then you listen to other MCs. Then you, you then you start to merge some things. You take some things that are positive. Yeah. Then you add it to your repertoire of, yeah. of skills. Still, how did you feel at that point though? Because it's hard to kind of like come from being a DJ and then giving it to a next man and saying to yourself, "All right, cool. Let me let him run it, and I'll do the mic." You, then you feel that itch to kind of like 
boy, you know what? I want to let me just come on and play a couple of tunes, and you come back on. Like, didn't you have that itch at all? You know what it is? Um, my vision always was. I know, because initially, a couple of you was like, oh, yo, are you giving up DJ? Yeah. And I said, no, I'm not giving up DJ. I'm just stepping aside because I have a longer term vision mm -hmm. for the sound. So I said to Dabda initially, like, don't worry, Dabda. It's all right. We're going to get some fight. We're going to, yeah. people are going to say, they have their opinions. They're going to say that, but there's a longer term vision in play here. So the same naysayers yeah. are the same ones that are saying yes now. So. Same, so you have to be careful with, with who you listen to yeah. and the, the, the advice you're taking. And from change people's people. opinions. More, more yeah, gems, yeah. more gems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you love giving out gems, isn't it? I don't like we'll to take say, it, we'll take it, we'll take it. I don't, That's like, the issue, yeah, <laughs> I don't really talk too much, but when I do, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I can't help it. Yeah. So the highlights, because I'm, I'm going to shoot, I'm going to keep shooting, isn't it? Back yeah. to the highlights. So I, I want to know about Jamaica. I want to know about, you know what I mean? Um, Jamaica was last year. Um, mm. But before that, there's a lot of events that, um, no, COVID. Yeah. That was COVID, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it was COVID. Yeah, COVID. Yeah. COVID, so. It was good. Even though it was bad. But yeah. of course. So did you mean beginning of 2009 or the end? The end of 2019. And then COVID okay. kicked in. So, so thing you think it was the. Straight into it. Yeah. So, yeah. so yeah. My, my thing was to dab there was. Let's use this time to get you ready for the road. Because I can foresee once the place opens up, we don't have no time to do what we need to do now. Mm. So COVID was a blessing. Mm. So man said getting ready like to say he had some training camp and all them yeah. kind of thing. <laughs> no, he had the no, gym and everything. What, you get me? Yeah, no, but it's, it, what people don't have to understand is at the time, Dabda was 19 going on 20. Uh -huh. You're going to start playing in, playing in front of hundreds, then thousands of people. So you need to be confident in the music you're playing yeah. and know the music you're playing. Um, obviously, we, we sit down and put the music together. I have the back knowledge. Mm. Dabda has kind of, he's the learning current. now and he's current as well, but he's learning the back knowledge as well now. Mm. So it's like, I have to guide him, he has to guide me. And mm -hmm. then there's a, a level of trust in that as well. So we have a good relationship offset and onset. So in terms of getting him ready, what did you have to do? And I, I know you said you had to like show him certain music and stuff. I, I, yeah, that's what I thought. I thought it was some rocky training and stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, well, that, 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 I think that I think that's for you to kind of yeah. yeah. Um, it was more like it wasn't really. It didn't feel like I was getting ready for anything. It just felt like we're just kind of bonding as a sound to kind of that shape and the sound. And obviously, he's going, "Ah, oh, you didn't play that piece of the rhythm." Mm -hmm. I'm going, oh, I didn't even know that piece. Yeah. And that's still happening to now because I went there in the 80s and the 90s. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I yeah. just know what I've, I've learned so far. Mm -hmm. So it's like, he's just kind of, when I, where I'm lacking, man just telling me, yeah. you know what I mean? And that's that's kind of what I need. Mm -hmm. And even like, vice versa. Like, I might tell him, oh, blood, that speech there, that was the one. Yeah. That one. Mm -hmm. So was, get, was I, I take it wasn't, was, was bonding quite difficult because like, put this way, me and him, we known each other from since infant school. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So us two bonding was never a problem because mm. that's how long we've been like mm. boys. Do you know what yeah. I mean? How was it for you guys? We spent a lot because COVID was there. Like we could only really have the cut spend either. He's at his mum's or his dad or he's at mine. Yeah. So more time he's just there. He's looked after. You know, everything's there. Set up there. Family yeah, family things set. Mm. So like studios there. We we're doing lives. So a lot of the lives was a prep for what we well, what I envisage or what we both envisage would come after that. Mm -hmm. So, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, what would forward after that? So we had to get ready for that. Mm -hmm. And and it was more about um, showing Dabda how you play the back catalog of music because he yeah. wasn't there. Mm -hmm. And some of it, I wasn't there. Yeah. But the way we play it, you would think that we was there. Mm -hmm. okay. 100%. Yeah. So everybody says, oh, 100%. like, yo, Dabda, for somebody so young, knows music. Yeah. But what they don't, yeah, it, it, it's, it's a collective. Yeah. It's a collective. Because mm. a lot of people do complain about the young people who actually play the old music only do it via BPM. Mm. So because it's via BPM, they're like, well, they think everything goes together. Mm. Yeah. Which, no. Just because it's yeah. saying BPM don't mean that this tune goes with that tune. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So you've done very well with that, bro. Yeah. And as a, as a DJ that started not playing 
reggae and dancehall. Yeah. It was like, how was I meant to know better? The only way I knew better was my dad would go, blood, you can't mix that with that. Yeah, exactly. I'd be like, oh, I don't know. This yeah. worked, didn't it? <laughs> what did you start playing? Uh, what did you start playing? Oh, it was just like what was what my brethren's, I mean, listening to, like drill, drill, when it was nice and early. Yeah. Afro swing, um, Afro beats, and obviously old stuff as well, but yeah. like, it was like, I was playing dance, so I was current going from... Current trends, basically. Not really. Yeah. Uh, yeah, current trends in that sense. Yeah. But then the other sense was, just songs that I knew that were big songs. Yeah. So like yeah. just like my dad, my mom's favorite songs, mm-hmm. my uncle and that. That was prior to. What's your, your vibes. What's your background? Indian. Indian, yeah. Yeah. Bad yeah. Indian. That. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. 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 And, uh, your, your parents are lit. You know. Yeah, they lit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, yeah. 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 The bad West Indian. The bad West Indian man. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah no, that's big. Did yeah. you get any fight back from the family in terms of the type of music you're playing? No, nah, listen man. to his parents, yeah, bro. Nah, not listen, not that, not that's what I'm Running them rhythms. My dad was yeah, happy, yeah, yeah. boy. My dad, he never comes nowhere. He's never nowhere. But when he sees something, he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's always complaining. He's like, it's not like the 80s, bro. You man are not playing it like the 80s. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, you know what? Them times, I wish. I wish. Uh, yeah, yeah, I wish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's changed now, isn't it? Yeah. And this but, is the thing. I think when Dabda joined, he was a DJ. He's now... Transcended into a selector, yeah, yeah. and it's a and difference. The same. Mm. And and it's the a difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of uh, you, we have a lot of DJs, but we don't have many selectors. Mm. Yeah, mm. and it's a difference. I hope a the audience difference. know what the difference. Yeah, I've not yeah. even born in the now, 80s. The yeah. fact is, parents are looking for a yeah. You should explain what that is. What is the difference between a DJ and a selector? You said it, man. No, you, uh, at the same time, I feel like some uh, some people are selectors and they can't mix. Yeah. So you know that like, you have you have to explain well, that's the being a yeah, but DJ then that, but, selector. Yeah, but then yeah, it's, have, a, it's but basically then, an all round DJ rather than just being a DJ. Do you understand what I mean? Or just being an all round DJ is a DJ that can select and DJ, but then yeah. obviously there's some it's DJs like who mix just mix with no mm. no no. But good why selection. would you? Why would you? Why would you say someone's a selector over a DJ? Because certain men have got good selection. Pick. Do you remember the original selectors from back in the sound tape days? Yeah. Were actually selectors. Yeah. yeah. They oh, would select the a song and give it to the DJ to play. Yeah. yeah. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah. So, um, like I said, it's like an all round DJ is the person who can actually do both. Do you know what I mean? Exactly. But no, I'm not saying what you're saying yeah, is no, wrong. No, no, what, just, exactly just, what you said was correct. Just, I'm just trying to understand. Yeah, where you, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, exactly what you said yeah. was a, yeah. was correct. Yeah. But he's more he's an all round DJ rather than just a DJ or a selector. He, he's actually one of them all round that can just play across. Yeah. But why would you say they were selectors? Because selectors, um, I believe personally, selectors can't mix. Because there's, there's guys that got jobs and they can't mix. They might even give like a a, a, but, a celebrity. So that's, that's, that's one but, reason. But that's one reason. But the, mm. the, the, but then the, there's you have, also you have the other reason is also is because it also takes the uh, it takes the onus off the DJ of having to try to find a song. No, well, but forget that. So well. that's what it used to look like. Yeah, with the the game shifted now. Yeah. So you you have to be a DJ and you have to be a selector. So yes. one person exam example standing around the sound, mm. he has to be a DJ selector. Yeah. Why would you say that person is a selector and not a DJ? Why would I say that person's a selector, not a DJ? In the old school days, like you mean current? Current now, because we we can't go back there. Um, there are selectors who cannot DJ. Yeah, there are selectors out there who, who know their yeah, songs one, and can't. That's one, that's one and, way of looking at DJs can't that can't put, select. Uh, yeah. can't put like mixes because together. Yeah, yeah. Because there's mm. someone that bad at mixing, but they're playing all the wrong tunes. Mm-hmm. That play, like it's like say to you, the, the man that comes and tries to play all the, the, the current tunes at the wrong time. Yeah, mm-hmm. I feel like he it, certain things get stripped from him. So yeah. the, the select so is, he, is he a selector then? Yeah, well, a bad no. selector. He's a yeah. Oh, selector. Yeah, he, yeah. He, he, he's not a <laughs> DJ. You know what I'm saying? He's no, he's a select. DJ, he's not a, a DJ, selector. not a selector. Yeah, yeah. no, because yeah. he might not even be able to mix. He's just coming to play the, the, the current tunes. Uh, it should be yeah, before nah, everybody it's, it's, else. It's, in, in terms of what we're talking about, yeah, he's definitely a DJ and not a selector. But yeah. basically, he's only got a small pot of music yeah. that he wants to play for but, whatever reason. And it's all yeah. now, now, yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> and that's why I feel like D, the, the, the new version of DJ came with LimeWire and things like that. Yeah. And from then onwards, it's just uh, CDs and you know, like all that kind of stuff. It's, it's changed in terms mm. of having to source your music and actually caring about what music you're playing. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? But mm. I feel like S- Selector has to have a like, I feel like you trained him into being a Selector and a DJ. Mm. He's probably a DJ already. 
exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, no, he was a DJ already. That's yeah. what I said. Yeah. yeah. He was already a DJ. That's why he liked it. Yeah. And he was saying, he told us what he was playing. But you turn to, like, I feel like Selector needs history. Maybe that's a good Understanding one. Understanding the history. Yeah, that's a yeah. good one. That's my answer. The selector needs history. <laughs> you got there, you got there, Jay. You got there. Yeah, 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 got there. yeah, I got there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Be good to see what Davda's answer is to that. What do you think, D? What, selector needs history? Yeah. No, for well, selector and DJ difference. Not history and DJ, like music history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, nah, the difference between selector and a DJ, for me, is a selector can, like, draw a tune. Mm. When... When it gets down to it, yeah. but a DJ might not be able to do that. Yeah. It might just be a bad. Yeah. You get me, but mm-hmm. um, that's not a bad thing. Like some some of the biggest DJs in the world, they got like thirty five songs that they play. Yeah, like every and they just change them every set, and they, not, they don't know nothing about this and this, and that like, mm. they're the biggest in the world. Yeah. But it's just a, that's the type of DJ they do that like, suited for that. But like mm. what we do, mm. we need to have. Well, I, we think I think we need to have understanding of yeah. music mm. has there been times where you've been stuck yeah kind of stuck where you, you got to a good point in the dance and you're like oh what should i draw next and you've consulted didn't you it's it's always a consulting thing it's always when, we consulting. Play. Okay. when we play we're always like just checking in like maybe go there after mm. uh cool, i guess that's just natural as the mic man as well it's just natural you feeling the vibe yeah draw for that next but it's experience that as well next. sometimes yeah it's experience that, so, um, that he's learning mm. and yeah, it's the experience that he's learning and growing to learn and that. So, so now, in terms of how often I check in, I don't have to check in as often, mm. yeah. respectfully. Obviously, sometimes I do, but I don't have to check in as often because he's got and more experience. And you kind of know what he's going to play. Kinda. Ish, 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 yeah. Yeah, ish. we, we always ish. got to understand, yeah, ish. DJ. Ish, yeah. Was the mic man thing new for you? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. how is it, how's this for you? Because yeah, as much as he's learning... You're a freshman in a certain part of it yourself. Yeah, growing. So how's that? How's that been for you? Yeah, it's been lovely because I've, I've got a growth mindset anyway. So I'm always trying to learn. So um, I spend hours listening to audio. Who? Who? who in particular? Who gives you the inspiration? Um, I I wouldn't say there's many because I listen to different audios because it's like okay, what would I say? Or yeah, what I say is you can't listen to just one particular person. You have to listen to a range of people because mm-hmm. if not, you're you're limiting your pool of knowledge to pull on mm-hmm. as and when you're going through different uh, environments. So mm-hmm. I can't go into a corporate event and say, yo, suck your mother, rare, rare, rare. <laughs> yeah. I can't do that. Mm-hmm. But then that's why you have to listen to people like a, a, a Rodigan or a Barry White mm-hmm. or them kind of MCs mm-hmm. where it's more about how you present. Then you might go into a dance or where you might you might be listening to a sound clash or you're listening to one of the, 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 the other hosts and you'll be yo, that's how they present their tune. So... We, you you have to listen to a, a wide range mm-hmm. of different audio yeah, yeah, in that. order for you to develop your style and what works for you and di- having different styles for different environments. So in, in that way, what he's just saying, sorry, D. Yeah. And that goes also back to being a selector. So as I said, I'll, I'll give you my definition quickly as we're there. Yeah. My definition is having a wide range of, mu- a wide range of musical knowledge of different genres mm-hmm. is one thing, but then also knowing how to play those genres. Hundred percent. In what order? And how? Yeah. And yeah. how to? But and yeah. And, and style and fashion mm. and pattern. So a lot of people might have the music. So I could give you my laptop, yeah. and say, "Yo, I've, I've got all the tunes there. You would play it different from me, mm. but I probably would bust the dance better than you. Not this. Dis- no disrespect to you, yeah. but it's because of I know how to play that music, 100%. and I study every genre that we play." 100%. So there's, when you see Davda playing the music, you're thinking to yourself, right, he's playing like he was there. Yeah. But then it, a lot of it is the, the work that we do mm. in the background. It's not just, we're just not giving it. No, but that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. so but that's how you that's develop fine. your, that's how you develop being a selector. Do you see what I'm saying? Because the DJ, I give Davda two tunes, yo, Davda mix that. Yeah, that's DJ. But how to mix it? Where's the punchline in the song? Mm. If you're mixing it before a certain punchline in the song, mm. you're going to have a hundred people over there say, oh, I want a bomb, but I'm a DJ, I don't mix so that's what I'm saying. That's where a selector comes in. It's not just playing music. You gotta know the song, mm-hmm. yeah. know where the punchlines mm-hmm. are in the song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Songs I'm get sorry, better in time. So yeah. Certain, certain uh, uh, tunes. Yeah, because you might get you third mix, verse. Yeah, you that's when the tunes start. Yeah, so I can't. Even, I'm dropping more gems, but you can't mix before certain times. Yeah, so yeah, like yeah. that, just slow down. Yep, you can't even mix the, it. The amount of times the DJs <laughs> put cross fade and I'll cross fade it back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The amount of times hold on, Dabda. Yeah, yeah. Someone done that. Yeah, I'm like Dabda. Hold on. Yeah, hold on. But then that's what I'm saying. It's communication. Mm. Yeah, hold on. Don't mix it. Mm. 
Yeah. Because you need, I know, like, and, like he's, he's getting ready, mm. but I know what the crowd's yeah. kind of doing because yeah. I'm on the front, front of it. Like, yeah. that's and the you, difference. And you could communicate that to him. Yeah. I said, Dad, the whole Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe there should be a higher word for a certain level of DJing these days. You know what I mean? Maybe <laughs> there, there, won't, be, there won't be, though, because, be. because some people just like what they like, mm. and mm. some people don't understand the essence or the foundation of how you play music. But everything has specialists. Yes, uh, yeah, you do have specialists, but then in every field. Yeah, but so nowadays, like, nowadays, your the problem you have is you can't be a specialist in one genre particularly because of the events that are kept. Agree. So you have to have we a do. jack of all trades. Sorry, mm-hmm. you have to be a jack of all trades now. Yeah, well, I think even, unless you're keeping your own events where you could do that. If you're a DJ specialist, yeah. The only thing you get away with is house. Sorry, house is probably the only one where you could be a garage. You could be specialist in. Sure. Outside of that, I wouldn't that say might, that. That might mean that you because it, that word's not used yet. So that word could, could oh, just be, it depends on it just it depends on where you're coming anything. from. If if you're in that arena or that's your area where you know everybody plays just one genre of music, then that's fine. Like yeah, 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 house, yeah. So I mean, yeah. if you're in a drum and bass, um, you're a drum and bass DJ. Mm. Blah blah blah. We are just in the actual multi genre DJ fraternity. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, you've so, got to be a jack of all mm. trades. But as much as your multi genre, you know which one pays you the most. Oh, yeah. Mm, yes, yeah, you let's do. Not, let's not do this. Yes, no, you certain do. Event, it, it just depends on the event. event. <laughs> what it, it is, on the event, it, it, it depends on the event now. It depends what it is. It's just what we are booked what for. Pay, so yeah. basically, it's, it's, the it's the one that we get booked the most for is the one that pays us the most. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So which one is that? No, you you get booked for your talent now as opposed to. But what genre pays you the most? I couldn't say that because. More, every event's different. Do you get picked book for pop music? Dab does us sometimes, yeah. For you Kiss. see that? See? And I would have never known that. Yeah, for Kiss. Yeah. If I didn't ask you that question. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah. this is why I'm talking about specialists that can do everything. Yeah, but that's what, that, that, but that goes back to the selector now. Mm. You Nowadays, before, as back in the day, you, you would have a man that would come play reggae. You'd have a man that come play dancehall. Mm. You'd have a man that play rare groove. Mm. Now, if if that man and comes they're all up separate, they're separate, all separate, separate DJs. DJs. Yep. If a man comes and plays all your genres before yeah. you, and you haven't got no back catalogue of different music, yeah. you're screwed. Because oh, then you're going to come back and repeat music, which is what, if you know the old generation, they don't like repeat music. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So again, that's just something that we're always cognizant of mm. in terms of when we play music. I don't like repeats. Snap. Definitely. But again, what genre pays you the most? Again, I, I, it, it's, it's which event? It's too, I think it's too mixed up to answer that question. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, literally, so there's no genre that pays you the most? No. Nah. So you wouldn't say dance or pays you the most? No, I would you say You could put like you things above. Pays you the most. Yeah, because it's nah. about the event you're hosting. So, so you, could have, you, have, you might have a normal event that holds Would you play the most? We play, probably mix. It's probably mixed, but we that, would like to play dance reggae and dance. Mixed, yeah, we would like to play reggae and dance or more. So, but what do you yeah. play the most? Yeah, probably reggae and dance. Ah, do you see how we have to go? Yeah, no, but no, but it's not the answer though. But it's still not the answer though. It's, it's not, it's not, not answer that question. It's, it's not, not answer the question. Yeah. It's, it's not the answer you're looking for. It's not, it's not as simple as that. Because you see, you said what pays. You said what pays the most. Yeah. What pays no, the, what most, pays not, the most? What pays? What pays them the most is not necessarily what they play the most. Yes. Do you know what I mean? Now, let's, all right. Say yeah, all right. So. I, 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 what this, I, this is a podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give, 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 let's give an example. Okay. So okay. So last weekend, David just come back from Marbella. Yes. He was playing pop music. Big. And, and he probably playing, got more money from playing the pop music as well. Vibes or just DJ Dabda? It's Dabda, it's Dabda Pure Vibes. Yeah. yeah. But the even that dance, I thought it was pop music. Next time, the man was telling me to play Taliban's and... Yeah. Other, yeah. Right. Because, but yeah. Then again, yeah. that's pop music as well. Exactly. So, that is pop, pop music. Pop yeah. music. So what yeah. is on pop music? <laughs> ain't, ain't the biggest songs of each genre of pop music? No, yeah. whatever that land in that... What, each country's got its own pop music as well. Let's just say that. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. When you go to different countries, their, their yeah. pop music, some, sometimes yeah. some a local guy from... You've got the Brazilian yeah, pop. Yeah, you there, got Brazilian like, pop. You've yeah, got yeah. Um, Arabic pop. You know what I mean? It's just whatever. Whatever is popular in that place. You know what I mean? Is their genre of pop. I still think it's so mixed up because I'm going I can go play French Amma yeah. in a certain club in London mm. and it's going off bigger than anywhere else in the world. Yeah. So then this is But that's why I said to you, you know, like and I was just trying to centralise, you know what I mean? And if, if it's that mixed these days, I'm accepting it. I ain't been raving in a long yeah. time. Like, yeah, like yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So for me to actually know what's popping now, I'm looking for the information, but I just know usually certain DJs will get paid uh, a certain genre will pay them more than a next genre. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. So you you get if you get booked for dancehall raves, you get booked for dancehall raves. Yeah, so the house, if you get booked for the house singing, so Super D, Pioneer, they're yeah. going to say, you're asking that question, they're going to say a house. Oh, house yeah, yeah, yeah. But they, yeah, they, they get booked for house music, but even they get booked in, in all kind of raves for house music. So like, yeah, they that's, might that's, even that's, get... That's, that's but it's always house music. But that's what I'm trying to ask. It's always house music, but for us, we can't do that. I play Afrobeats a lot. Like, if you look at a play count on the laptop, Afrobeats, the plays are up mm-hmm. because yeah. it's just was was popping yeah. definitely. right now. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. So okay. it's it's plays for the audience in front of you, which yeah. is what I selected as as well. So how do you describe pure vibes? Your style? How do you describe it? Is it unique? Uh, yeah. Tell me about pure vibes. When you not looking, what do you think? What do you see? <laughs> what do I see? I see um. Because then that'd be that'd be good to know whether the it energy. I'm saying the part. I'm I'm I'm, I'm putting you on like seven eight o'clock. You're on a day party. Everyone's in the place. They just need that up. They need that lift. All it is for and you're going to take them to that lift. The name sounds Jamaican. So, <laughs> yeah, but yeah. 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 vibes. Yeah. yeah. So that's, that's that's what I see. I see you. You're going to have your towel around your neck. You're going to swing the towel around. Everyone's going to absorb to your energy. So that's that's how I see it. But how do you describe it? Try to play with the purest vibes. That's it. I like that. That's it. I, like I want to like, connect with the crowd. Once, once the connection is there, it's lit. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. 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 So, you hear him there? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That was leading this one, you know. <laughs> yeah. This is really this. It's, it's, it's just all about yeah. playing like well, obviously, like play good yeah. and play for the people yeah. and and the party. Sometimes the people think they want to they wanna go mad, but they don't know they've got four more hours of raving. Mm. 100%. So you have to go, That's right, you man. Mm. Settle down right now, like <laughs> everyone chill out. We're gonna do a nice set for you. Yeah. Then them man are gonna lift yeah, up. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. And that, always just playing position. Yeah. Do you not have yeah. your own event? Huh? Do you have your own event? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Which one do you use lots of event? Synergy. Synergy. Yeah. I've heard of that as well. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And how you organize that event? Is it same same to how you'd organize a set? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And just just go into that. I'm saying a bit more because it's DJs now, not just music. Yeah. yeah. So how you, do you organize that? Uh, kind of how we want the night to flow. Mm. Yeah, yeah. But I don't progressively get to that point which Dad was Dad was referring to. Earlier. Yeah, give me give me, a line, climb. give me a lineup. So it'd be like R and B, then you know you might old school dance, or then you might get some Afro. Who's, who's so, on there? Who's on there? Who's uh, on it, there? it varies. We use that, cool. We got flyers from, from from from. It varies. From, I don't from, want to. I don't want to single out any particular sound because no, we use I'm a, not, um, just just right. the anniversary. So the yeah. anniversary, you've got us pioneer. Um, Alan Brando, mm-hmm. Invasion, Spangy, Swaybo, mm-hmm. yeah, Terminal. Terminal Four. So we rotate the lineup. Big. Yeah, Big. we always try to give everybody a chance. Big. Yeah. Do you host as well? Nah, but if you're at my birthday last year, <laughs> you would have seen me. Yeah, I saw the Instagram. Uh, you know the reason why I asked that you 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 have a shy demeanor about you. Oh, Is that like, true? Wait, what, what do you mean? You you seem like you're quite a shy guy. In, in public, but then yeah. today we've seen a different light. Mm. Like, this is the most I've heard you speak ever. Uh, ever. <laughs> yeah. And you do come across quite confident. So yeah. I'm actually quite surprised still. Is yeah. it? Um, yeah, I think it's this time and a place. Like, yeah. when I'm excited about music, I'll be the loudest guy ever. Uh-huh. But otherwise, I'm kind of just... Laid back. Is that true? Yeah. 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 Everyone's cool. Yeah. It's cool, man. Yeah, yeah. 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 But yeah, I, I, hosting, sorry, hosting one day maybe, but... Yeah, um, you're building yourself up yeah, to it. Yeah, right now I'm inching in 2007. So <laughs> what, what, was it like to, what was it like for you the first time, not the first time you hosted, the first time you decided that you was not going to host from behind the DJ box, mm-hmm. but stand out in front of the crowd mm-hmm. and say, yo, I'm there. me and you, I'm inching at the place. Mm-hmm. What was it like for you? Jeez. <laughs> um... Me and David talked about this, mm-hmm. and I was like, "I'm letting off some gems here. I'm about to." Um, You've been doing that all, all, all session, mate. Yeah, but you know what? It's for me, as an MC, and studying the game from COVID, I realized people just don't. Music is not enough. Mm-hmm. Agree. You need to provide a level of entertainment mm-hmm. when you're performing, mm-hmm. and if you've got a confident shooter behind you. Mm-hmm. And you're firing, and you're just cause the way I see it as I'm the I'm the sniper, I've got the 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 target mm-hmm. on top of the gun. He yeah. just shoots. Okay. So if I'm not aiming, so you prov- you basically you provide scope, the gun. I'm the scope. He's yeah. the shooter. Yeah, yeah. He presses the trigger. Mm-hmm. So if he if if I, if the scope isn't on the target, he's gonna miss. Cool. Mm-hmm. 
So you have to be aligned. Mm -hmm. So on top of that, you then have to add a level of entertainment to the crowd. Mm -hmm. And I'm always looking at things that the other MCs are not doing. Mm -hmm. Did you did so, you did you go into this mind frame just before COVID, or is this something that you've always this is the way you've always thought about doing your thing? My mind frame is I'm a student, so I always will study. Yeah. I, one thing I one thing um, one thing people. I don't like to be outworked. Mm -hmm. So you like, might have the better talent than me, cool, I accept that. I, mm -hmm. I, I might be limited in that area, but I won't be outworked. Yeah, that is your talent. And that is my talent. But then how did the nerves feel the first time you actually stepped out in front of him? It was just like the test. It was a taking the test. Because mm -hmm. if I've done the homework, mm -hmm. I've done the prep, yeah. I've done all of the things to get me to that place, then it's just execution then. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean, and and and, I, and I had to, we just had to throw each other, mm -hmm. each other's selves in the deep end in order mm -hmm. to get there as well. Did you do the thing of looking in the mirror and in in your room and be like, yo, blah blah blah? <laughs> did because nah. that's that's something that a lot of people do, even mm -hmm. actors do it. So yeah. it's not even a a, a funny yeah. thing, you know? So nah, it's just a switch on and switch off. Mm. To be fair, because offset, I'm just like both of us is very relaxed, but when it's working time, it's working time. Yeah. Mm. You know what I mean? So it's a switching on when it's time to switch on and then when you set time, you switch off and relax. And it might, it might be a silly question, but was there like the big hosts as well, the ones that you've seen been doing it for years before you, were they in that dance at that time? Because sometimes that could yeah, be, sometimes, sometimes, that, could be that little fair factor yeah, there. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, they have like, that as well. Oh, I, I yeah. Got, you know? Yeah, yeah. Like Jamaica was doing a little bit. Mm. Yeah, because obviously it's thousands, different country, first time. For Dab Dab, but mm. also first time for the sound playing out there. Mm -hmm. yeah, what's your what's your first words when you got on that stage? What's your first words? We didn't even do. I had my flag. Mm. Yeah, no, but no words. There was no words of flag. We had an intro. Ah, oh, easy. We had an intro. <laughs> oh, oh, that's that's a good, that's we that's said good flag. Which flag you have? You had English or Jamaica English, flag? I had the English flag because okay. that's what we're representing. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. What, so explain British to the flag. podcast where we're, Jamaica. Uh, what, so yeah, sorry, but like, Dream Weekend mm -hmm. um, last year, twenty twenty two. Yeah, no, Dream Weekend. Always wanted to do Dream Weekend. Yeah, yeah. Can we get a round of applause for Pure Vibes Dream Weekend of twenty twenty two? How you mean? Yeah, you mean? You doing it this year? No, they've got somebody else but we'll talk okay. about where we're going i know i know i know you did this year yeah yeah, yeah. We, but we're going yeah, elsewhere it's a, pr it was a proud moment though yeah, yeah, yeah. and and if, if for your parents as well like how was that telling them yeah that they understood it yeah. how big it was yeah yeah yeah. it was big for big because um how i see pure vibes is is the uk representer worldwide mm -hmm. respect oh what where, huh yeah no, because no. i don't i don't, I don't think Respectfully, there's a gap there. I think thousand percent. There's a gap there, so why can't we be that? Yeah. And that's where the ambition is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? So when we're going certain places and like, and again this year we're going somewhere new, which we'll mention later on. Mm -hmm. That's the vision. Right, right. That's right. the vision. Mm -hmm. Do you see what I'm saying? So where where we're going and where we're working towards, it's 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 not just local. And when you said to me earlier, oh, do we represent? you know which part of london we represent it's not about that because UK. when when we're going abroad it's uk and london they know mm -hmm. and maybe you know other cities as well but mm -hmm. they don't want to know about the ends and mm -hmm. our mindset isn't always about the ends respectfully mm -hmm. yeah we play there don't get me wrong but even when we voice dub plates is uk london north south east and west why am i going to get alienate everybody mm -hmm. when we're here to bring inclusivity in mm -hmm. terms of everybody mm -hmm. it's right. not about right. exclusivity it's about mm -hmm. inclusivity and making yeah. sure everybody's represented in the dance yeah. or the event or whatever it might be and we're playing music to represent everybody mm -hmm. so you know what i mean it's just the mindset's just different here the I'm, gems, I'm, the I'm gems. just waiting for the dreadlocks to grow in your head bro yeah. Listen, he's been doing it he's been doing it for the past hour he's been doing this for the past hour he was doing it off camera at the very beginning yeah. how you mean yeah, yeah. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just the and, 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 and the tracksuit them look like it yeah, just nice. come out the wrapper. The, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, like fresh, it just come out the packet, bro. Fresh today. Yeah. Fresh yeah. yeah. Brandon's a very yeah. important yeah. Your yeah. So go on, anyway. The flag, UK flag. Yeah, so World Out Dreams play the intro. Um, How much uh, people in front of at, at that time there? Uh, probably a good, maybe a thousand. A thousand people. Maybe a thousand people, yeah. I think Carnival was probably bigger than that in terms of the amount of crowd that we played at okay but that was big yeah where was that where was this a dream weekend okay yeah down the grill so that dream weekend got more than a thousand people there yeah but at the time i think where we played i okay. think yeah roughly okay. was about okay. that 
but yeah, they definitely had more than that. Yeah. So you had the intro, and then what? Big tune, first what, big tune. What type with the UK flag? Yeah. Obviously, find out who's from where and where. No, hang on, no. Oh, where's the you said, one? You said um, you went up there and said something. Oh, I don't know what you said. You said, oh, hang on, I forgot something. You made it look like a mistake. Yeah. And then you went back to the bag, got out the UK flag. You said, where's the one UK people? Okay. Yeah, they did say yeah. something. Yeah. That yeah. was yeah. 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 Oh yes, I bigged up everywhere else. Yeah, you bigged up everywhere apart from UK, and you hang on. And back. Okay. Yeah, so okay. I'm constantly thinking about things to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Give me a my idea. I might do that Cancun jump off next year. I'm just talking about. I'm just Damn. talking about the flag business. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 We walked up with the flag. Yeah. And then um yeah everybody once UK saw we were there yeah they represented as well so yeah, yeah, yeah. we just played the music and yeah did our thing. Are you was you guys the first people to represent at Dream Weekend for UK properly? Well, they, they, had had ma- the- they had Masters, I think Master Sips and Cold Sips that did it before us. Cold Sips has been doing it for quite a few years, but obviously yeah. Cold Sips is not a DJ. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. I mean? yeah. So, mm. other than Master Sips, probably, yeah, we're the first. Okay. Yeah, we're the first. I didn't even know Master Sips been out there. Yeah. 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 Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I think we have proper, proper representatives. Mm. Where else have you been abroad? Uh, we've done Malta, um, Portugal, Amsterdam. Um, Turkey, yeah. um, for the rest of the year, we've still got Zanti. Oh, what else have got, D? Zanti. Amsterdam again. Yeah, Amsterdam. Was it Zanti Shadman? Was it back? No. no. Okay. Uh, that would have been in, that would have been in May. Yeah. Okay. And um, we've also, which, so look, we were both looking forward to uh, America, mm. Florida and Atlanta. Oh, nice, um, nice. Yeah, so that's. Where's that? September. September. Okay. Yeah, so that's like a, that's one of my personal dreams anyway. Yeah. Mm-hmm. To play yeah. in America. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that, yeah, it's crazy how, yeah, we didn't do Dream this year and we've got somebody else, but then what, look what happened. Yeah. America's yeah. opened yeah. up. Yeah. So I think, I think we're going to, I think we're going to buck up in certain places. Yeah, yeah. 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 So just in terms of fulfilling the vision. Yeah. Yeah. As a brand mm. and as a collective. Yeah, in, in a short space of time, a, as well. short space of time, within four years. Yeah, yeah. Four years. but as I said, that that ha- that's happened because mm. that has been able to take the music load off me, and yeah. then that my yeah. the mind starts to work in terms of vision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And don't get me wrong, he he helps with that as well. It's not just me, but in terms of the moves, yeah, we have to make real strategic moves. Your favorite hosts? I'm 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 talking worldwide and UK. The ones that you probably the ones that you've looked at the most and said, yeah, that you've got most inspiration from. Okay, so I listen to every host. I would mm-hmm. say, um, Dodd's good. Yep. Um, Cappuccino's good. Yep. Mm-hmm. Um, Hooligan's good. Yep. GF's good. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, Prince from New Movements, Birmingham, he's good. Okay. Um, who else? There's, see, the thing is, I, I'm trying my best not to alienate all the hosts because they they all because in terms of as a host, it takes a lot to be a host. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, even listening to Dags in the early days, it it takes a lot to be a host, mm-hmm. and a lot of people don't understand that. But then also, you have to pick what you like from those hosts, and then see how you can integrate it into your exactly. style. So I can't really say one particular host because I listen to that's why I said like yeah, hosts, you know yeah what I mean? like I listen to a, a range of them and I probably so, I probably respectfully missed out a couple no disrespect but yeah. there, there's so many that especially when you're put on the spot yeah yeah so, there's so many in terms of like worldwide sound men um, so I like like Soul Supreme Sound I like listening to them um, you got Bass Odyssey mm-hmm uh, Mighty Crown Creativity. So, let's say the, select, the, the, the actual the actual names oh, of the people. Um, Jakes, yeah. yeah, Jakes is good. Yep. Um, uh, who else we got? Jakes, Kingpin from King Addies is good. Yep. Dynamic. Oh, uh, these dance or sounds? Yeah, yeah these, uh, these are war sounds. Crash mm. so yeah. The Blunt Posse, Ajax is good. Uh, well, that's where you get a lot of inspiration from as well. Yeah, because that's what we've grown on the sound yeah. system side yeah. of things. So you listen to them still, and you actually see Chris Diamond's good. Um, yeah, there's so many so, different mm. hosts we listen to because mm. I just feel like there's so many things you can pick up from everybody. Yeah. Yeah. You, yeah. As I said earlier, you can't narrow 
your Everything's things down. Yeah. yeah, you can't. You you have to keep listening to audio. Mm-hmm. You know, and I just constantly listen to it. That's all I listen to is audio. Yeah. New music, obviously, Dub will bring that to my attention, and then yeah. I study it and yeah, develop. Speech and do you record? Really. You record all your sets and listen back to them. Yeah, we try to. We try to. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can if you can go record it. Record. It. Mm. Mm. Yeah, we can. You got dub bits as well from yeah. the big artists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Any, any big ones that you want to sh- kind of share uh, with us? Chronics. Chronics. Yeah, got Chronics. Uh, Berries. Got lots of Berries. Mm. <laughs> Bounty, Beanie, Lombardo, okay. yeah, Cobra, Shabba. There you go. Um, okay. Who else? Capleton. Um, Bushman. Um, and this was before Davda joined as well. No, nah, so so when Davda joined, I voiced, I started, I, 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 at the time I started the sound, I was a student, so I couldn't voice, afford to voice doublets. Mm-hmm. But obviously, um, as Davda joined, kind of wanted to make sure the sound is multi-purpose so if we wanted to clash we can clash if we wanted to juggle we can juggle we can do both so you have to have dub plates in order to clash to defend yourself mm-hmm. and then juggling we voice juggling dub plates as well so we're kind of trying to keep the sound system element mm-hmm. in this new age How are you? yeah because i feel like your sound needs identity if you're not it playing dub sense. plates what else stands out from your sound mm-hmm. respectfully mm. Because that's what we know it as. Yeah. You, if you, you back to your age group, yeah. like that, so your era when you started ninety five. Yeah. Yeah. What would a the man then play? Yeah. Double plates. Yeah. That gave your sound the difference yeah. between an yeah. X man. Yeah. So yeah. if a man's yeah. hearing you play, yo, mm. man's yeah. a joint for a chronics or a berries. Yeah. yeah, we're not the same. Yeah. We're not the same. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get berries. Uh, uh? You can't get berries dubs like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But we're not the same because yeah. you're just a forty five sound. Respectfully, I'm not dissing anybody, but I'm just saying you're a forty seven. But how I know it. You Stone should love. them, man. Clash them, man. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, this them. Call them out now. We're calling them out. Yeah, you know I mean, it's anyone wants to battle identity. pure vibes, it's about identity. When you listen to pure vibes, there's a difference. Hundred percent. And that's 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 how I feel the sound should be sounding. No, but definitely. So we're lo- we're lost. We're lost. clashed. We're lost. clashed. Well, we had a clash in 2020, but that was um we're fully equipped, uh, and that was online. Mm-hmm. Okay. We haven't done any live clashes yet. Um, it was fully equipped. Uh, so yeah. What was their what's their names and the DJ's names? You'll have to research this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 I think Professor Inchi at that is He's on game, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's ready. Yeah. I brought his what spirit. Who is your friend? Who yeah. yeah. is your friend? Trust me. Yeah, quite a few guys. Um, so yeah but we just feel like we just want to be as i said it's all towards the vision of being a uk Mm. flagship sound yeah i think the uh the quality of dubs now are a lot better than they were back in the day when i say you can't hold them you gotta hear you gotta hear me out you gotta hear me out you gotta hear me out let him land let him land let him land so the reason why is people I think now I'm making their dubs sound more like the actual song mm. rather than a freestyle over a beat, which sometimes didn't connect with the actual, no, no, I get it, I with get the actual audience outside of the sound fraternity. So if you're yeah, playing but, in a regular party where people like to rave, do you understand know what I mean? Yeah. They're not into the sounding. <laughs> you know but, but there's a difference there. Now, is, is, a bit, no one don't oh, respect that place. Is it the quality? Talking about the quality as well. No, I'm talking about the quality in the dub plates that they're making. They're more sounding like their actual songs now, rather than it being a case of them sounding like a freestyle over. Because it what's now a good fits, example of that? So, I mean, so it now fits into both categories. So you can actually play that in a dance, where it's a it's a uh, it's a sound dance, and you can also play it in let's say a Studio Express dance, where people are not so much into the. Uh, That's a good example of it though. So the, uh, I, I tell you why what, I tell you why the, why the, why the, the, the bar meet has changed. Like, in um, in in the nineties and the early two thousands, it was more about exclusivity. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you had to have different dubs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that's why a lot of the dubs would be freestyles per se, mm-hmm. and then the next sound we're going to voice it. Okay. However, now we're in a uh, 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 environment where everybody's voicing the same set of songs. Mm-hmm. So you then have to now say to that the the artist, okay. I want my song to sound like the 45. Mm. As close as the 45 as possible. That's always my instructions, especially yeah. when it comes to juggling dubs. Yes. Close as 45 as possible. But however, if 
if I want the song in a war way, then it's sound kidding way. That's the difference. So, yes. so, so, and then also you can voice songs half and half. Mm -hmm. So half kidding, half sound kidding, mm -hmm. um, juggling, half okay. sound kidding. Mm -hmm. okay. So it depends on how you want your dub to sound. Mm -hmm. But from, I mean, you go back to the olden, oh, I won't say the older days, but. Um, go on, the late the late the late 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 the rest are the Kilimanjaro mm -hmm. bought them, Sizzler bought them artists to the forefront. Mm -hmm. Now, if they weren't, if, if Ricky Trooper wasn't confident in presenting new music mm -hmm. at the time, he wouldn't have won certain clashes and he wouldn't have stood out because yes. now they've become cornerstones in dance hall. Yeah, yeah. Bro they yeah. broke songs. Yes, mm. whereas now you're not breaking songs anymore yeah. because TikTok is taking that away from sound systems. Mm -hmm. um, Instagram and the rest of them is taking that away from sound systems. So now, you have to voice what everybody's voicing, so to speak, but you you and you just put them on different rhythms mm -hmm. to still give it the sound. Yes. Vibe. Yeah. Do you yeah. see what I'm saying? Yes. Yeah. So that's where we're at mm -hmm. in terms of it, because there's not many artists you can break like that anymore, because they're breaking on TikTok before we even get the song. Yeah. Do you think the youths them even know about what a dub play is? Yes, they do know a dub play. They might not. They know the difference. The, that they might not know the difference between question. a dub play and a special. Yeah, let's ask the youngest person in the building. <laughs> that that question is important because, like, the answer could be no. They don't know what that is. Mm. So if you go on a dance now and play a bit of dub plates, and it's not sounding like the forty fives, the originals, you're gonna have a problem with the youth. Mm. They don't know if it's sounding like this. They know. Oh, they know what that is. Yeah, it's that song, but it's mm. the same my man's name. You knew exactly what I was talking about yeah. in terms of the quality of the actual. Dance. Yeah. So you got that. That's what you got an advantage of now. I could get like a dub could be given to you and you can just warp it to sound exactly like the 45 if you mm -hmm. want to with technology. Yeah. But them times you probably couldn't do that, innit? Yeah, it's one take, one take. Yes, I, I feel like the whole point of the dub was the, that it sounded like my man just went in the studio for you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. like that was what made it even more special. Like the guy has just gone in the studio mm -hmm. for you. There's, it's, it doesn't even sound like the recorded thing. Exactly. It yeah, so, like that's, just so that's when, you, that, but that's when you're trying to do a bit more specials that you're leading to or mm -hmm. you're clashing where you're trying to do something you are busting brand a new artist or you want to have a counteraction yeah or yeah, there's something yeah, special yeah, yeah, there's something, that, yeah, there's, or something new i thought that's what that was yeah. probably it's for four slightly it can be but it's also giving your sound a identity mm. yes you know i mean yeah yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah, yeah. Definitely, because definitely. if you're definitely. playing what everybody's playing it, yeah at least play it's in a dub play it. yeah mm. oh, okay yeah the man have that on dub oh, okay that's we'll why man, have to, man have... so so you, you you start commanding a level of respect yeah exactly that's why man, man have to come and clash pure vibes for the for the title <laughs> <laughs> I'll be the promoter. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but it's about respect. Hello, thanks. It's about your identity and the identity <laughs> you want to put out there yeah, as yeah. a sound system. Yeah. Do you see what I'm saying? Because when you're going into different countries and they hear, rah, Chronix is calling out his name, or you know, Beris is calling out his name. Yeah, of course. You command respect straight away. Straight yeah, so away. He, even when I go, when I go hear a sound and they're playing good and then they got dubs, I'm like, yo, this is. Man, hard, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, like, it's like the first time we all saw Mike Crown, for instance. Yeah, Chinese, yeah. you see two Chinese, Chinese man there. And, and you think you're big double play. play and they, they shut the thing down. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. and you think it's a rap. Mm. <laughs> but that's their identity as a sound system. And yeah, I feel yeah, that's yeah, the yeah. grassroots, regardless mm. of anybody. Everybody's a juggling selector. Mm. But you have to be able to do both if you can. Yeah. What about the rest of the year? Because I've short time and I know you got a chill. Yeah, yeah. So I got um, Kiss. Yeah, Atlanta. Still. September. So that'd be good. Atlanta, Florida. I'll do a long weekend out there. When you when you go to Atlanta, I try to link up with my guy, Jai Lion. Jai, okay. Cool. He's a, he does a um, Ricky and Smiley morning show okay. out there. But yeah, good guy, Jai Lion. Oh, cool. mm. All right. We're well, in Atlanta there. Um, and then we're doing October. We've got Zanti and Turkey. And then November is. Amsterdam, yeah. an anniversary. You should be an anniversary, so yeah. yeah. But he's bugging it. He's remembering. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we got those things to sort out, and then end of the year, obviously, yeah, and then next year. So, yeah. So pure vibes to the world, yeah. Yeah, man. That's mm. the that's the work zone, isn't it? So, mm. yeah, so, yeah, so where do people get the tracksuits from? Uh, well, just really yeah. 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 Shout, shout out to the world. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah, but yeah. even that is just something different. We just felt yeah. like tracksuits. Nice. Um, no, they're nice banded, as well. Yeah, 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 yeah it's it's casual like, as well. Neat, neat, neat you know what I mean? If you're paying a hundred pound or hundred fifty pound for tracksuit at night, why not invest in yourself? It's tight. 100%. Why not invest in yourself? And that's why the mindset's different because yeah. people spend a hundred fifty pound on a night tracksuit, but wouldn't spend else. spend how much did these cost us? Uh, seventy pound on a tracksuit mm-hmm. with Definitely. your own branding on. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Make yeah. it make sense. Yeah. So you're selling it for sixty five. No, <laughs> that's the cost. Of, that's the price of us. <laughs> Much more than that. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, you gotta make it make sense. No, hundred percent. And it looks yeah. good. And I, and I just, I just feel on. like, um, respectfully, mm. respect. That's one part. Respectfully, people is hustling backwards. Yeah, hundred percent. I think so. So you say you got more gems? Go ahead. That's good. Five minutes of entry. I just, I just, I just feel they're hustling, <laughs> just hustling backwards. Mm. Just hustling backwards. Yeah. You know what I mean? You would. Right. You know what I mean? You wanna spend money on I know drip, but why? Why not? Your laptop cover. You haven't got a laptop cover. Mm. Case in presenting your sound. You're not. You know. You got no headphones. You're coming to the decks. No headphones. Ask him, man. Ask him, man. Or the headphones got sellotape. Or the headphones got sellotape on on them. Or you know what I mean? I ain't seen you in a branded t-shirt yet. You're spending. You're giving Balenciaga, Mari. Mm-hmm. 200, 300 pound. Yeah. Make it make sense to me. Yeah. Low self esteem. Yeah, come on. Low self esteem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the issue. Mm. What do you mean? Yeah, so just, I just think just make it make sense. Even, you know what I mean? We've got winter jackets. Mm. Um, yeah, we just make it make sense. Mm. And all the print, and you got the whole set. Yeah, yeah, the whole set. Yeah, the whole set. So it just got to make it make sense. Yeah. And I feel a lot of people just don't no, make it make sense. Yeah. yeah. And I, I even like the way you've um, presented it, and even the way you're talking. Because not saying I've never looked at um, the whole um, DJ thing in that way, but you've spoke about it like a business today. Mm, Do you know what I mean? Yeah, and like, yeah, I, yeah. I don't think no one's ever spoken about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Like a yeah, business yeah. like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. And I don't know for you, it must be a good look to have him there. And he, obviously, as much as he appreciates yeah. you, and, it, and he's he's told us how much he appreciates yeah, you today. I you know what I mean? Yeah, just having that someone yeah. to yeah. guide you, yeah. you know, like yeah. jumping all, in the game. All thanks to Twitter. Yeah, like, and you putting that mix I mean, up on lines? It's X now. Yeah, it's X now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, why is it X? What? I don't know, man. Ask you. Oh, you're late, then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, is it? Check your phone. What? Check your phone. It's not like a Twitter. Yeah, it's called X Check now. And it's on your phone already. It's on your phone. That's what has to come forward. 100%. Vision. Yeah, vision. You have to put your vision first, man. And yeah, You've got a good dynamic between you two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see that. You can see that. And it's contracts as well now. We operate with contracts. You see from outside, what you can see is the journey. Yeah. And you can see the experience you come and establish. And I can see that you appreciate that. And outside of appreciating it, you actually respect it mm. and that there is actually a hierarchy mm-hmm. and it's not a hierarchy that's dominant it's that one one that's appreciated mm. and it works mm-hmm. you see when you trust in somebody's vision you can follow it mm. but if somebody doesn't have vision there's nothing to follow mm. Mm. Gem for gem. <laughs> Clashing blood. Come into that, Nigi. It looked like you don't like smile too much, you know. It looked like you, you just, you kind of, you know, want to hold back the smile. What happened? No, I'm there, man. Yeah? <laughs> so it's like, easy. certain time I look at you, it's like, Okay. Yeah, you know, wisdom is not the most smiliest of people. Yeah, yeah, it is. As long as it was late, and he's still, he's still holding that against him. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you take off the smile. Yeah. 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 He's saying he's not smiling. He's smiling with the rest of us. Yeah. He's looking at you like. Yeah, to know. Yeah, to know. And I'm smiling with you. No, but I just, I just feel like you have to behave as if um, you've made it. And and what I mean by that is don't be late. <laughs> no, no, it's not only that. But it's a level of professionalism. But if you're going to, if you're going to book EZ, now it's contracts, right? Yeah. It's yeah. deposit, right? Mm. Mm-hmm. So, if if we're trying to, if we're trying to aspire to get there or get to how we we have to start behaving as that. That's right. Mm-hmm. So when people approach us now, like Dags would say to you, Dags, I say to Dags, because it's you, you're okay. But normally it's a contract. Mm-hmm. There's this and there's that mm-hmm. that you have to fulfill. Mm-hmm before you engage with us yeah. and it's it's behaving as if you're there and, mm-hmm. I, and I said, I'm not saying it from a big headed perspective no. but you have yeah. to walk in what you want to see yes. what's your vision yeah. you have to walk in that otherwise you get otherwise you get the long end yes. <laughs> of the it's, stick it's, yeah. it's the difference between <laughs> business and personal you know if you want yeah. things to be business you have to stick to things being in that yeah because their, their, pri- their, their price has gone up way way higher you know, way higher 
It ain't. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, 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 it, but it's also it's commanding respect I because, respect it. because, I respect because it. I respect the way the way I see the, the game at the moment is we don't do what everybody else does mm. we don't bring what everybody else does mm. so you have to pay for that mm. you have to pay for that mm. because 100%. and everything's gone up so where before COVID the, a price of the rave would be £10 for example now standard is 20 mm. Mm. so therefore why should my price stay, stay at 20 mm-hmm. In terms of in relatively price to and value are two different things. Yeah, but I'm, mm-hmm. but then it's this price and there's value with the price as well. Mm-hmm. So the value of us has gone up. So mm-hmm. we're not doing what everybody else is doing. So if you want us, you're gonna have to pay for it yeah. respectfully. Hundred yeah. percent. And that's how that's how we see it. Yeah. Dab right. on kiss. Yeah. yeah, tell us about the kiss story for quickly. <laughs> Round up, um, quick, quick and fast. Yeah, I was doing radio, like online radio, with my brethren in college. Then I went to Westside in mm-hmm. Hanwell. Westside Radio. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm still there. Mm-hmm. And then 2021. Is that Jane McGregor was over there, wasn't she? I think she was there. Yeah. She, she's actually. She's over at Kiss as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So then 2021, I went on Kiss Fresh. Mm-hmm. And yeah, doing Kiss Fresh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Got a dance yeah. show. Okay. Mm-hmm. Times, times. Um, Saturday, 7 to 9. Mm. Yeah. And that kind of. And the thing about that, that kind of. Um, Adds to what we're doing. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, can so, I, can I so one more question again. What? Genre pays you the most? <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to get asked. <laughs> for radio. But in, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it kind of co- coincides or adds to the sound system that the perception. Brand, the brand yeah, yeah. Because like he does. Written. Yeah, he does the interviews. Help. Yeah. Sometimes they give us dub plates, okay. um, jingles, or jingles. And even like mm. that, we did. I yeah. uh, interviewed Cranium and that, and then we played. Pure guys played at the show, and they all kind of when it's all oh, tangled yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. good. That's, yeah. that's kind of. How comes you're both ain't on? You're both not kiss. This they dub has always been doing radio. I don't do radio no. Yeah. Well, can't you go on there? Do? Uh, sometimes guest shows, but um, yeah. outside of that, it's just, I don't features. Do, yeah, special features, but so more it, outside. So Pure vibes is just DJ dub though. On kisses, Davdo. Davdo, Davdo, yeah, Davdo. Because yeah. so, yeah. yeah, when he started radio, it was always Davdo. Okay. Yeah. So he's, he's about to leave you then. <laughs> no, I'm <laughs> joking. <laughs> On that note, uh, that, that, I'm sure, that I'm sure was comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> that was pure vibes in our studio. Yeah, man, Big got, show, got, got massive got show. Got Massive show. Thank you for We apologise for long as being yeah, a bit a tad late. Yeah, long and being long. But yeah, we yeah, got there. It's good, yeah, good yeah, energy. Yeah, it's good it was money. a nice show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of gems got dropped. So yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. And also, you know I, I don't. I really, you, I, before you, you touched the point about hi- hierarchy, I don't. I just kind of want to address that. There is no hi- hierarchy. In, 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 yeah, it's a partnership because yeah. what he's good at, I'm not good at, and what I'm good at, he's not good at. Yeah, so God, it's man. never a dictatorship like that. No, yeah, I might deal with a lot of the admin type of stuff and, and the vision issues, stuff and, and issues, and as, and issues well. as well but yeah. that doesn't mean that he's not dealing with the mix CDs or mixing dubs or whatever so there's, mm-hmm. there's value in terms of both of what we're both doing it's not just mm-hmm. yeah, 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 no, yeah it does well like that it's, yeah. and that's, 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 that's yeah, older yeah. and younger thing no, it's no, not that, it's not it's that. that. Yeah. Yeah. but he's big brother so big brother little brother yeah, yeah, but, then, brother. yeah but I'm still learning from him Yeah, okay. so it works both ways it's not just so eternal students are always learning yeah that's how you last are you manager Huh? He's manager. Who? His. Who does it? I said bye. I said bye a long time, you know. You know what? I said bye a long time. Before we go, 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 before Mm-hmm. So all I'm doing is knowledge transfer mm-hmm. to him because mm-hmm. obviously I went through um, your residency playing to no one, starting at £50. Dab does in four years has bypassed that. So I've had to share a lot of knowledge. Yeah, but I've had to share the knowledge quickly to him so he is up to speed. Yeah, and he fast-tracked him, man. Yeah, fast-tracked. But I didn't do a bit of that, though. Yeah, yeah. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know that. Yeah, yeah. But in terms of... Yeah. You know more. Um, no. I'm give you knowledge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So that's his flowers to you, bro. Because yeah. you don't want to take no flowers. I'm noticing that. You don't want to take no flowers. You have to. 
But you know what? Before we go, like I was about to say, before we go, um, I found this T-shirt just the other day. Um, it's I want to say R.I.P. Going out to a guy called Elroy who used to supply a lot of guys with clothing who was in the industry, um, and he had this brand called Celebrity Gaming Club. So yeah, I mean, big shouts and R.I.P. Going out to Elroy. Yep, yep. This is my nephew's little okay. brand here, so yeah. whatever. I think it's his old brand still. So yeah. big him up. still big him up, really T big yeah. up. Yeah. Big up really T, yeah. my bird Jim. Eight, 18 years of age, you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 That's, that's how they do it. The DJs so, yeah, as well, you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 A big salute going out to Pure Vibes. Thank you for coming in. Where do we find you? Where do we find you quickly? Where do we find you online? All of the social medias, Pure Vibes ENT. Yeah. Done. Yeah. Boom. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. yeah, Loggers, respect. take it away. Why? Well, it's already done. Respect. Subscribe. 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 Subscrib